the UK? Assalamu alaikum, Sheikh. Assalamualaikum. Um, Sheikh, um, at the time of marriage with a, with a lady, the father was nowhere to be found. So the mother lives with the daughter and uh, the, the brothers. And so we couldn't consult the father. So the brother approved and the marriage went ahead. A couple of years later, the father came along. Initially, he wasn't um, happy, but later on he approved. Um, does the marriage have to be repeated or that's sufficient? Okay. First of all, the Prophet said, alayhi salatu wasalam, there is no marriage without the presence of a guardian, a wali. And no one can override the wali or the guardian's permission just because he was not found or because they don't want to. So what, you, what they have done was wrong. And the marriage where the brother of the bride was her guardian is debatable. And most jurors would say that it was invalid because they have overridden their original guardian's approval and consent. Only the father can give his daughter in marriage. If he was not to be found anywhere, they tried desperately, then they should go to the Muslim court or to the Islamic uh, uh, center, the authorized Islamic center, and consult the authorities what to do. If the authorities are convinced, because most, if not all, such similar cases, the girl wants to marry the boy, they don't want to tell the father because they know the father would not agree. They tried to give him a call once or twice after midnight and the mobile was off, so they said, we tried our level best, let's get it over with. And this is a trick that does not pass upon Allah Azza wa Jal. So if he is now accepting, then they should renew the marriage contract with him being the guardian, proposing to the, uh, the man that I'm giving you my daughter in marriage, and he accepts in the presence of two male witnesses, and this, inshallah, would uh, uh, rectify things. May Allah forgive them all. Uh, sad man.